Good morning, welcome back to another vlog. We have to get ourselves together today, but we just went to Target, picked up a grocery order, so I'm gonna show you guys what we got. Something, I look in distress, okay. All right, it's okay. Let's show them what we got from Target. So, we got paper towels. Michaela got Oakley these shoes. They're blippy, right? Blippy shoes? Yeah. They're cool. Okay, then we have water wipes. Yeah. Snacks. We got a lot of snacks, right? Because our favorite word is snacks all day long. We have these plum super smoothies. We have eczema. His eczema has been so bad. I don't know if it's just the new house. I don't know what it is. A new toothbrush and toothpaste. Look at that. Oh. We have more veggie straws and more veggie straws. I knew those were going to be a hit, huh? Those are yummy? Yeah. Yeah. Then we have these strawberry gummies. We have um, snack bars, apple flavor. Oh my God, these were kind of expensive for this small little thing. Yeah. I, I thought these were yeah. going to be so good. Yeah. These are mamas. These are Muddy Bites waffle cone snacks. This was like five dollars. I thought this bag was gonna be huge, but they look really good. Yeah. Then we have these. These were also kind of expensive. They were like eight something. Mm -hmm. Think sweet treat. Like that looks so good. Chocolate and cream cupcake. We'll see. I got seaweed because I wanted Oakley to try seaweed. I wonder if he'll like it. I don't know. Then we have more gummies. Then we have, ooh, these are new from Alani. They had a bunch of like Alani gummies that are new. So I got the Alani gummy smoothies. Ooh. I don't know. Moving on. We got more snacks. We really had to fill it up. More snacks. Chewy, this is new from Target, chocolate chip cookie dough. Like I said, I look at the new things weekly. So I also got apple and whatever, those bars. I got these Lara bars. Snacks, snacks, snacks. I got this. I mean, some people probably will think this is gross, but I actually kind of like it, so I got that. Um, I got this for Oakley. Moving on, I got the Outshine Lime Bars. My favorite bars have been out of stock. So I got those. I got Uncrustables. We got banana. These bananas don't look that great. Yucky. Yucky? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Oakley, what's mama's name? Sadie. Sadie, and what's dada's name? Yeah. Scott. And what's Teddy's name? Puff. Puff. Good job. <laughs> I love asking him that. Okay, next we have this crunch pack. I got that as like a snack for him. I got this for a salad for me. Oh. Oh. And then these mush things are so good. I really like the vanilla bean one. So I got that. But then also, someone's texting me. I also got, okay, I also got blueberry. Blueberry's delicious. So I got two of each. And then in this last one, what's this? Holy sugar. I did not think this baby powder was gonna be this big. Oh my God, this is massive. Okay, well I got baby powder. All right, and that's my little Target haul. We gotta put these things away, right? The electrician's coming today. We're finally gonna have some cable and internet. Thank the gods. Can you be careful with that? My stomach is pretty big right now, but we just went to TJ Maxx. So I wanted to show you guys what I picked up. It's actually Scott's birthday today. So I put together like, well, I'm going to put together a gift for him. I got a pineapple refresher from Starbucks. Oakley got his cake pops and then he got trucks from TJ Maxx. So he's playing with that, but let me show you what we got. Also, I need to self tan because my face is pretty tan and my neck and then all of a sudden it's like white. So we got a tan tonight. But first thing I got is the Heavenly Hunks peanut butter chocolate bites. I really like these. Um, they have a couple different flavors of them, but I really like them as like a little snack. I got these all-purpose scrub pads. I feel like when you move into a house, all of a sudden, like the first two weekends, you just have so much to buy. So I got these, because I'm like, we're gonna obviously be constantly cleaning. 
I got a stainless steel cleaner and polish for our fridge because there's already like print marks on it from you know who, so got that. And then we realized last night that we don't have like a salad bowl, so I got this. And of course, it's like a really pretty pinky nude. It comes with like the little spoons. I'm like, sorry, the lighting's going in and out. I'm like, this is so cute, so pick that up. And then for Scott, we have two different bags. The lighting is, sh okay. We thought we were gonna have good lighting. Um, two different bags. I got Scott this hat. He loves Adidas hats, so I got him this one. He has quite the collection now. I got this for Oakley, Just Do It. It's, this was $6.99, little t-shirt. I got this for baby girl. $5.99 for this. Look at how cute it is. $5.99. I got Scott these Cotton Crew t-shirts because he wears these underneath like his dress shirt sometimes. And then I think he's really gonna like this because this is like a golf shirt. Calvin Klein polo with the zipper. So I got him that. Oh, and then I got him a soap and then I got me a soap. I didn't get anything for myself besides a bar soap, but it's okay. I didn't need I didn't need anything. I got him this Sandalwood Adventures soap bar. Oh my god, this stuff smells so good. So I got him that. And then for me, it's just literally because of this pregnancy. Oh, you're showing all the cars? Nice. Um, I'm into like like the other day I was smelling the Lysol wipes. And it's a pregnancy thing. Sorry, I'm like talking really loud over him, but um, I'm obsessed with Lysol wipes. Like the scent of the lemon Lysol wipes. I'm like, oh, it's a pro, it's a problem. Anyways, I found this lemongrass soap bar. Oh my god, what is wrong with me? This happens when I get pregnant. It's just I like cleaning and like lemon lime scents. So I got that. On another level. Okay, baby, show the camera your cars. Show the camera. Why? You can't see it. Back up. Just can't show. Cool. That's so cool, baby. All right, I'm gonna put this stuff away and drink my drink my pineapple drink. Good morning. It is another stressful day. Um, I'm hoping the day turns around though. But we just left the ER because Oakley tripped and fell hit his head on a cast iron radiator. So we went to the ER because his temple was all swollen and we were just obviously concerned parents. So we went, he's okay, he was monitored for a while and now we're back home. And yeah, we're trying to bring back the day. We're trying to get less stress today. So I got a package in the mail and I wanted to show you guys because these cakesicles are so like dreamy, they're like, way too pretty to eat but i'm gonna eat like three right now because i'm stressed so let me show you okay are you kidding these are so beautiful i'm obsessed so someone reached out to me on instagram and asked if she could make me these and i was like um absolutely these are stunning i didn't even know like what design she was gonna do or anything but she knew i was like craving like lemon so some of these are lemon and chocolate chip and strawberry shortcake and i think there's like a cherry in here and they're just so beautiful like i don't want to eat them because they're so beautiful but i'm definitely going to um scott and i had to resist last night but i'm going to link her down below her company is midwestern magnolia baking and they're just beautiful so i'm gonna eat these well i'm gonna have a couple right now good morning another day another day of nothing fitting me I think I tried on like five different things and just nothing fits my body. I almost cried, but I didn't. But like all my oversized t-shirts. Can you please leave him alone? I'm gonna pick up Teddy because he doesn't like being chased like that, okay? And he's been sick. It's been one thing after the next. Teddy's been sick. We're, uh, we got some, we burned some sage, okay? We need some good energy in here. But um, yeah, nothing fits me and it's like, 
it's really like sad always acting up i don't know if it's just because we moved into a new house but he's like not being nice he's doing a lot of you okay water let's get some water right here listen listen to mama you can't run with food okay go sit down and eat your food okay um yeah i don't know if it's just because we moved but like He's been a rat hitting and just, I don't know. And he's been terrorizing Teddy. So anyways, um, we just went to Target because I had to get more snacks, believe it or not. Like we ran out of snacks so fast. So I got the Nature Valley muffins. Michaela's stopping by. She got me a sandwich, which is so nice. Um, I do have gestational diabetes. So, I mean, that's pretty obvious, right? <laughs> um, I got these, these are new, granola minis, strawberry flavored. I got some stuff for some sandwiches and I got some stuff for some tacos for the next couple of days. I got apples, I got these special K bars, I got sweet potato, I got those bars. If you guys haven't seen my like last video, hold on. My last video talking about these, uh, or one of the last videos talking about these pops. They were back in stock. These are the best. So, pink lemonade fruit pops from Target. Yes. I can't wait to see how big this baby is in another week. Because, um, what's going on? Like, I know I don't eat the best, but... Damn. Anyways, um, I got Tide Pods because I mistakenly just got fabric softener. So I washed three loads of laundry with just a fabric conditioner. So, okay, Ted, it's all right. All right, I'm gonna put this stuff away and then catch back up with okay, you. So I'm literally getting a stress rash. I don't know if you can see that. It's hives in a line on my chest. You see that? Yeah, those are hives. <laughs> Just because of how overly stressed I've been lately. So, um, hopefully that goes away soon. But look at me, I'm in Scott's shorts. I'm in, I did have this as an oversized t-shirt and now I'm like, I'm feeling a little bit puffy. My baby shower is in a week and a half and I wanna try on some dresses. You wanna come in here? These are my dresses that I have as options. Now, let me tell you guys, I love this one. This one is from Shein. It's beautiful. It's like perfect for my theme. But when I put this on, I'm literally like, it's laughable. It is a beautiful dress. It's laughable on. So, I mean, I might try these on in this video. Should I try this one on? I don't know. It's, it's really funny. Um, and then I have some potential dresses from Revolve. So I kind of want to try the ones on from Revolve because this is like a contender. I don't know if this is going to fit me, but it's so pretty and I'm like, please fit me because I will cry if nothing looks good. I will literally, literally cry. Okay, so this is dress number one. I'm not going to wear this for the baby shower, but this is such a cute like little sporty dress. It has the slit right here. This is from Revolve. I'm gonna link all these down below. I love how, like, the comfortable material this is. Did I even make sense? This is well-being, being well. I love this brand for, like, workout gear. Am I okay? <laughs> you guys know what I'm saying. This looks like a little tennis dress, and it's so cute. So I'm gonna try this on. It's gonna be really short, and the bump's gonna be bumping in this. So I'm not gonna lie, I feel like um, like I'm a milky bar. I feel very milky in this. I don't know how to describe it other than that. But it does have shorts underneath, so that's a plus. I think this would look a lot better if I wasn't pregnant, because it doesn't really suit the bump, I don't think. But it's a cute like tennis dress, I'd say, if you're not pregnant. Or maybe if you're pregnant and you just have a round bump, and I don't know, because me, I'm like, I'm round all over so cute but definitely not for a baby shower and i honestly can't wait to wear this like next summer 
Okay, I think this one is a contender. It's a little boobalicious, so I might have to do something up here, but I really like the colors of this dress. Do you like this dress, honey? You like it? Yeah? I think it's really pretty. I'm definitely like very bumpin', but it's got a slit. The issue is I don't know if it's like too scandalous. Like I, I might have to um, do something up top. Okay, what are we doing? But I really like the colors and the pattern of this one. So this is the dress that I had my hopes up for. I was like, this is my baby shower dress. It's perfect. Well, I'm busting at the seams because the buttons go down it and see how it's like separating. You can see like my skin going down. <sighs> so it doesn't like fit. It's like such a beautiful dress. I'm obsessed with it. Definitely my favorite thing that I got from Revolve, but I don't think I can wear this to my baby shower, you guys. It's just like busting at the seams. Like, could I wear something underneath it? Would that work? Like, I don't know. To me, it looks like... <laughs> this is like a colossal bump. I look like I could like do damage to someone with this bump. With like the right angle, I could just go... I could do some damage, I don't know. I'm disappointed because this dress is like really, really pretty. This is the last thing I got from Revolve. These just like swishy, really comfortable shorts. They're like little tennis shorts. Is this well-being? Yeah, well-being again. So, I mean, they're really cute. I have two more dresses I wanna try on. This first one is actually from my online boutique, which I no longer have anymore. And then the second one's from Shein. So, let me try these on. Okay, this one's making me look slim on the sides, right? This could be a contender, the problem I'm having. This is from Shein. I like it. Um, it has yellow and green flowers. This rash is bothering me. It has yellow and green flowers, which the main theme of my baby shower is pink. Like pink floral. So, so God, so sorry. But the weird thing is, is check out the boobs. It's like they don't fit in these pockets. Oakley, why are we, <laughs> what are we doing here? Okay, they don't fit in these like pockets. So look, <laughs> I can't even stand the way. Why isn't this like longer or something? Like it's cutting it off here. So it's like squeezing it. Okay, can this work or is this too far gone? Cause like, I like the way this looks looking at it from the front. The side were cute. It's just the side boob. It's like, they're like clamped. <laughs> I don't know. So this one's like the most comfortable. This one's the one from my online boutique from a while ago. And I just have like a lot of extra boutique things in boxes that I don't know what to do with. So now tell me not, this is like really pretty. I like the flow, I like that detailing. It, now it's the top that I'm like, what's going on? Like too, too frumpy or something up here? What do you guys think? What's your opinion? Are any of these good? I don't know. I know how badly some of you are gonna want me to try this on. I'm telling you for my own sanity, today I'm not trying this on. I'm not. Um, um, should I try this one on? No, because it'll be too short. That one's also way too short because I tried it on for a photo of me and Scott. Um, ooh, where was that Princess Polly one? Maybe I should retry that one on. It's just like plain white. Let me see. So this is like reality of moving into a new place. Um, all of our stuff, well, all, a lot of my stuff is over here still. I have to put it all away, but I just like, I seriously need help. <laughs> Cause it's like too much. I'm gonna try on this white dress. My final straw. This is my final straw. <laughs> Why does that keep ringing like that? There's a show on that's ringing like a real phone. The cups are way up here. What's going on? No. Good morning. I just came back a little while ago from the doctors. I had another baby appointment. Um, my blood pressure was normal and I'm like, I had really bad anxiety going into this appointment because it just like felt like something was off. Um, 
but my blood pressure was 122 over 80 something and I'm like no way <laughs> It just didn't seem real, honestly. I thought I was about to be admitted. But anyways, I have gestational diabetes. I think I maybe mentioned that. So I'm gonna take my blood sugar with you guys on camera. I had Hawaiian rolls with turkey and cheese in it. I had two of the mini ones with turkey and cheese in it. And a granola bar. So I ate it an hour ago. They told me to test two hours after but if i do test one hour after then it has to be under 140. so we're just gonna do this thing luckily scott's like a pro at this because he has type 1 diabetes so we're gonna trick i also have to get the tdap machine i mean the, the tdap shot today this is not enough blood i don't think okay that makes sense it needs to be under 140 if it's an hour later so 134, I don't know if I should mark that down or if I should wait like the full remaining hour and then test it, I don't know. I don't know what to do. But my numbers have been good so far other than my like uh, fasting number. It was 98 yesterday and it was 99 today. So it's a little bit high, but I don't know. We're gonna keep tracking it because I only have numbers from the last two days so we'll see i also got a date i'm not gonna say what the date is but i also got a date for when this c-section is gonna happen so that's exciting um it could be sooner if my blood pressure starts to go high but right now my blood pressure apparently is normal so that's the story I wanted to show you guys our beautiful rug because we got this in the mail, I think maybe over a month ago, but we haven't been able to like unroll it. So this is what it looks like. As you guys know, I'm going for a very like Victorian, warm, cozy, royal theme for the living room. So this is the rug that I got from Well Woven. And I've actually had a rug from them in the past. It's in Scott's office right now, so I'll show you guys that. But look at how beautiful this is. It's like soft, it's plush. I love the colors of it. And Teddy likes it too. Um, I'm just obsessed with this. So I'm gonna link this rug down below. I'm also gonna put the name of it on the screen right here. But it's just so beautiful and royal and soft. And I'm like nervous when Teddy goes on at Oakley, like literally anyone, I'm like, I don't want this rug ruined. Um, but it's so comfortable and so pretty. So I just wanted to show you that. We haven't had, we don't have like our couch yet, but without any furniture on it, this is what it looks like. I was debating putting it, oh, sorry, Ted. I was debating putting it in our dining room, but I think it's more of like a living room cozy vibe. Plus I don't want to like spill food on it. So yeah, it's so, so pretty. I will link this exact style down below for you guys. And we have to get our vacuum so I can start like cleaning it, but I think it looks so good. So picture this with like a cream couch without those two. I don't know, it's gonna be so cozy and like chandeliers and like curtains, yes. If you guys remember this rug, we've had it forever. I think we've had it for like six years now. But this is also from Well Woven, and I just love it so much. Like, I just can't get rid of it. Um, it's really good quality. Uh, we do have to deep clean it, so we're going to rent, like, a rug doctor and deep clean it. But it's one of those rugs that is just, they last so long. So, yeah, I also have this one from Well Woven. Super good company, and I'm so glad to work with them again because their rugs are just beautiful. Okay, so I think I'm going to end my vlog here so I can pick it up and start a new one. I hope you guys are enjoying these more like home videos. Let me know if you wanna see like more unpacking because I still have those boxes and it's just like, whoa. But I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.